हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज अबाउट क्लिनिकल पैथोलॉजी केस नंबर फोर विच आई हैव पोस्टेड ऑन माय इंस्टाग्राम राइट सो प्लीज गो थ्रू दैट क्वेश्चन एंड सेम थिंग आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू अगेन हियर सो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस दैट इन डिटेल क्वेश्चन वॉज अबाउट ट्वेंटी ईयर ओल्ड मेल राइट एंड ही डाइड बिकॉज ऑफ कार्डियक अरेस्ट आफ्टर दैट वॉट वॉज डन ऑटोपसी वॉज डन देन हिज क्लिनिकल फाइंडिंग क्रॉस फाइंडिंग एंड माइक्रोस्कोपिक फाइंडिंग्स आर गिवन सो वॉट वी हैव टू टेल इज द फाइंडिंग and the diagnosis of this condition and which mutation is responsible for this appearance right so let us see one by one when you are seeing the microscopic find uh, sorry gross uh, clinical finding what you are observing here he is having a very uh, characteristic type of woolly hair right so this is called woolly hair number 1 we are seeing in this patient and if you are looking at the uh, examination of the palm and sole you are seeing there is a hyperkeratosis of palm and sole so these are the yellowish thick area these are the looking dirty muddy area they are the areas of hyperkeratosis excessive amount of keratin has been deposited right where on the palm and sole so woolly hairs hyperkeratosis of palm and sole these are the findings on the clinical examination now we will see on gross examination what we are seeing see there are this is the cut section of the heart where one side we are seeing the left ventricle and this side we are seeing the right ventricle when you compare the wall of the ventricles you can notice that left ventricle wall is looking brown in color because these are normal myocardium so remember this is the normal myocardium because they are looking brown in color so this is absolutely perfect so problem is not in the left ventricle problem is in the right ventricle right ventricle what we are seeing in right ventricle now you can see that instead of seeing this brown wall you can see there is a yellow wall and there is a whitish area so this whitish area which you are seeing is a fibrous tissue right and this yellow area as we all know that fat is yellow in color so fatty tissue is yellow in appearance so fatty tissue fibrous tissue has replaced entire myocardium so you can see that no brown color is visible here so what we can say that fibrous fatty tissue has replaced the normal myocardium that same thing we are going to see on microscopic examination also in the right wall so when you will take the section from here what you are going to see that now this is the special stain called as masson trichome stain right so try to understand this is masson trichome stain where this red color appearance is the normal myocardium this red color of the myocardium normally it should be supposed to this much thick right this much thick but now what has happened this has been reduced to this much because this area and this area has replaced this normal myocardium right so now you can see that this is the normal myocardium and this area which is looking clear these are all fat cells and in on masson trichome stain the blue color cells are the connective tissue or collagen right which are forming the fibrous tissue so fibrous tissue is blue in color so what i am showing you fibrous fatty tissue fibrous fatty tissue has replaced the entire myocardium now you can see only the remnant of myocardium is visible here so that's what we are seeing normal myocardium is replaced by fibro fatty tissue fibro blue color fatty empty color right so there is no color they are empty looking cells these are actually fat cells so this is how we are seeing a picture of arrhythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy so this is called as arrhythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy usually it is an autosomal dominant condition and they are associated with desmosome protein mutation right i'm talking about arrhythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy i'm not talking about that two clinical finding i'm not including that two clinical finding of the woolly hairs and the uh, hyperkeratosis of palm and sole gross examination i have shown you thinning of the right ventricle wall why there was a thinning because of the fibro fatty infiltration microscopic examination same thing we have seen normal myocardium was replaced by fibro fatty and this patient will have sudden death because of arrhythmia so that is why it is called as arrhythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy now come to this clinical case this clinical case is having three important features number 1 woolly hairs number 2 hyperkeratosis of palm and soles along with arrhythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy so all these three things together they are called as nexos syndrome so now you understand so in this case we have discussed the finding diagnosis will be diagnosis will be nexos syndrome right and you now you understood nexos syndrome is woolly hair 
हाइपर केरेटोसिस ऑफ पाम एंड सोल्स and arrhythmogenic right ventricular cardiomyopathy these are the triad of the feature and in these patient what will be having mutation so they are having mutation of the placoglobin gene so that is very very important point so we must remember that placoglobin gene mutation will be seen in naxos syndrome so keep on seeing this clinical pathology cases it will be highly useful for all exams including fmg inict us assembly or neat pg so keep watching other lectures also on my uh, youtube channel my best wishes to all of you bye bye